So folks, um, over this quarantine period, I've been looking at activities to do with kids. Uh, and one of the things that I've always been interested in from my childhood days is uh, model railroading. And I uh, thought I uh, would introduce it to my kids as well. And um, so I got into uh, and bought a model railroad set from Bachman, which was a DC set, uh, pure analog DC set, and uh, set it up. Uh, it was a lot of fun, but uh, uh, but was lacking in some ways. So have now bought the Bachman Echo Valley Express, their DCC or digital command and control set and uh, have set it up. I wanted to share it with you guys and um, hopefully it helps out. Um, and it's a lot of fun. So we got the Bachman Echo Valley Express HO scale model. The great thing about this one is that uh, it comes with the DCC controller. Uh, this DCC control by itself is about $200 and the set is about $240 at this time. It goes up to like $300 plus, but uh, you can get a good deal on it on eBay as well. Uh, it uh, comes with a steam locomotive, uh, which is a DCC enabled uh, for sound. So that's a, it's a great deal, I think. I feel like getting this set is a great deal. Uh, anyways, we'll unbox it and lay it out. Right now we have this existing track. We are going to, this is not DCC, but we're going to add some more parts to it and make it DCC enabled so that we can try to run this locomotive using DCC. DCC stands for, of course, uh, for those who don't know, uh, digital command and control. This DCC system is really good. I can operate like three trains on this. And this one is a DC locomotive that is running currently. So as you can see, it's coming by. It's running on this track, outside track. The switches are aligned to allow it to run on this outside track. And a little bit of a shorter loop. Now let's run the steam locomotive, which is over here. Uh, which is running on number three channel. So that's three. So now this, this building steam as you can possibly hear. And we can blow the whistle. the bell and we can start moving I moved it too fast so it got the slow speed is really good but I think I moved it actually the dial was sitting on the for the diesel locomotive so I think that caused it to start moving really really quick need to remember to actually uh, see which, which switch it is sitting on so see you can actually control it really slow change the direction hopefully that Release steam. The sound is speed sensitive. So while that is running, 
let's go and control this diesel locomotive as well so that is running on channel 4 and we can turn it on the diesel locomotive is running and switch off the light if you want to in the direction and in the meantime the steam locomotive is coming over here I wanted to crash into the other track. Over there. And let's start the steam looking at it also. Thank you. 